So what do we use revolve for? Making balls. Can you make balls with them? <laughs> Probably things you do on the lathe. Yeah, anything on a lathe is a good example of using revolve. Because you draw half of it and it spins it around. But now again, still you can break it down into smaller pieces. So yeah, so like on this, is that tapered on this one? This, this right here. I'd probably do probably do this piece, this bottom piece is one, one sketch. Then I'd do that as a sketch. Then I'd do that as a sketch. Three different revolves in pieces. Because maybe I decide we want a different belt or something that's going to, or, I don't know. It's, ski rope. It's, oh, for ski rope, yeah. So maybe I want to be able to use a bigger rope. So I need to increase this. I don't want to have to change that whole sketch. I just want to be able to tell it this to be tall. And then this will just move up. I won't have to adjust any of this. And then I'll come back and put the holes in. Okay. I'll do holes tomorrow. Because uh, there's, there's a hole feature that actually is pretty smart. So for holes, you want to use the hole. So I, I do the outside of it in three different revolves. And then I can put the stuff in the middle. <clears throat> so I'm going to go to revolve. And again, I'm going to start at my origin. And now I can just draw, draw straight from there, right? Because I want to revolve around the origin. So I might as well do that. So if I was going to do that piece, I'm over. Yeah. So it went straight or down. It went something like that. And that is the most complicated sketch I would do, probably. That's five lines. That's almost as complicated as I'll go. And I might not even do that. I might do it square and then come back with a chamfer later. Right? So that then I can change the chamfer to change that that angle there. Well, I'll go ahead and do this so that was. See what happens sometimes if you don't but you can just bring it back. gave me a line because I was looking at that would be just an edge right so I, on my sketch plane it's a line See how I, kind of I move 
there's a line, there's horizontal. And where I move changes the kind of dimension I get. Then all that. So I can kind of build it up like that. So that would be my how I would build that part. Just a couple of revolves, one after another, to, to get to the final thing. Because now I could change the height of this without affecting this piece. Or I can change the height of this without affecting the top. I can adjust each thing independently. Okay. Questions? I could also sketch on here. Maybe I want a notch there, a keyway or something. that's on your physical sketch or construction line. So just sketch a line. So you do that and just... Screw that down as a cut. So you, you can kind of join your revolutions, your extrudes to get your final part. Any questions? Did you figure it out? Let's see which let's see what'll work. Which one are you? Well, is this uh, one? Yeah. Alright, so So if you pick right axis revolution, then you pick this line here. Yeah. And say okay. Open sex scalper. that it's only clean at one point. Must be that corner down there. So we won't let you revolve something if you have overlapping lines. Yeah, you can't do anything that's overlapping, but it might be that. Let's try and just pull that point back a little bit.
it's the fun of doing it. Yes, I'll just take that. There you go. Yeah, maybe it was just because it was hitting at exactly one point, or maybe that point was crossing it somehow and you didn't like it. Yeah, if it if it doesn't like it, you don't do it. There's no way to make you do it. Now that's a no ball. Yeah, so you like if you wanted it to hit at exactly that one point, you'd have to fudge it a little bit, maybe make it like if it's because it was just a sharp corner, maybe it like one hundred thousandths of an inch up. And then, then it would work, but at exactly one point it won't work. Sometimes you have to fight it just a little bit. Not that you, there's no way you can machine it that fine, but it's gonna, it, it'll make the model right. And you won't notice a difference if you do a rapid prototype or anything like that. So.